This problem is similar to the exercise that it's next to. Uh, and what we want to do is to sketch the graph of the straight line which goes through these two points. And we also need to find the equation of this line. So uh, there's really two parts. I think I'll first find the equation of the line. Now to find the equation of the line, remember how it's done. You find the slope of the line and then you can find the equation by using either of the points. All right, the slope is two-fifths. Remember how you find the slope. You take the difference in the y values and you divide that by the difference in the x values. So on the top you have 3 minus 1 which is 2 and divided by 2 minus a negative 3 which is 5. So the slope is two-fifths. Therefore the equation of the line is y minus 3, that's this 3 here, is equal to two-fifths times x minus 2. That's that 2 there. Now I could have used this point also. I could have said the equation of the line is y minus 1 is equal to two-fifths times x minus a negative 3. And it would all have worked out the same way. So then I find this and it's convenient to go ahead and simplify it, which I'm going to do right here. All right, the next thing I will do is graph these two points. So you see here they are. These are the two points. One of the ordered pairs is 2, 3, and that's that one. The other is the ordered pair minus 3, 1. And you see, since this is a straight line, you know what its graph looks like. You could just take a ruler and draw a straight line through those two points, and then you'd have the graph, wouldn't you? But I'm going to go ahead and uh, do the graph next. Okay, now here is the graph of that straight line. You see here are the two points that we graphed, and then there's a straight line that goes through them. 